Hello and welcome back everyone, it is Flip the Bacon. We are continuing on with part 15 of our blind let's play of Undertale. Uh, in the last video we ran into an undying and managed to escape uh, him or her, I think it's a her, from attacking us. And now we are continuing on with um, going through the caves. We went up sands and he put a little dot on my eye with a trick here, uh, trick telescope. And now we are continuing on with this place and... Uh, an echo flower that's not doing anything all right so we're in like kind of like a swampish looking area of this game and we're running into oh man oh wow so washa and Aaron appear this 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 could be bad uh, fighting these two um, you reach out watch every calls from your touch tweet yuck Ooh, I'm sweating Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh yeah, they said the dodge down there was harder. Um, Masha will tell a joke. You tell a joke about a kid who slept inside and his powers are neutralized. Tweet, no, that joke's too dirty. Ha, my kind of humor. Yeah, blue means I can dodge. Uh, smells like underwater barnyard. I think we can get rid of... Uh, what? We could just straight up. Um, that was not what I was expecting. Washa is friends with a little bird. Um, we'll clean. You ask Washa to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Tweet green. Green means queen. And of course, all the greens are in the wrong uh, direction. Um. Let's see here. Touch. You reach out. Watch every calls from your touch. Tweet yuck. Uh, Washa is looking for some good clean fun. Yes, Washa to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Tweet. Green means clean. Um, maybe I'll send one of these green ones this way. Smells like detergent. And now we can uh, spare... Luckily, uh, wow, that's a ton of gold there, by the way. Um, well, we got the lights here. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? We'll take it. You got ballet shoes. Mm, and nothing else. Let's check out the ballet shoes real quick. Um, ballet shoes, weapon. Weapon, attack seven. These... These used, used shoes make you feel incredibly dangerous. Um, huh. So, yep. We got some ballet shoes there. Um, papaya. Ring, ring. There's no response. So, he's not talking to us anymore at the moment. And we are continuing on our merry way here. Um, ring, ring. Hello. This is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about your cloths? Well... The friend who wants to know, her opinion of you is very murdery, but I bet you knew that already. And because you knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing, a dusty tutu. Because I knew, of course, after such suspicious questions, you would obviously change your cloths. You're such a smart cookie. This way, you're safe and I didn't lie. No betrayal anywhere. Bring friends with being friends with everyone is easy. Ah, thank you for screwing us over there, Papyrus. Um, like a true friend. Um, let's see. Come on. In the water swine. Wash your soul. Let's see. Aaron is splashing you playfully. Um, wash a clean. You ask Washa to clean you. It hops around excitedly. No need for swimming. No need for swimming suit. Green means clean. Aaron is sweating bullets. Um, Aaron. Let's see. Joke. You tell a joke about a kid who s slept in the soil. Washa power neutralize. Huh. Nice. My kind of humor. And, uh, let's see, smells like a muscle farm. 
Good. We got rid of him. Darn it. Out. Darn spot. Okay. Woo. Oh, come on, buddy. Let's see. Watch us rinsing off pizza. That's really weird. Green means clean. Alright, send me a green one, buddy. Send one this way. I can actually get... Alright. Come on, Washa. Uh, and I just end up running into that too, uh, just get that over with. You hear a passing conversation. Don't say that. Come on. I promise I won't laugh. You know, the Echo Flowers didn't say anything earlier, but maybe I didn't click on them correctly. Um, so, we're going back to check them out. Washa shuffles up. He asks Washa to clean you. It hops around excitedly. Green means clean. Washa's looking for some good clean fun. And we end up being washed there. I'm not even sure what the hell Washa is there. Um, looks like a duck floating inside the, um, a wash tub potentially, maybe? I don't know. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm. Just one, but it's kind of stupid. See ya. You heard a pass passing conversation, so you don't have any wishes to make? Okay. So we're hearing some wishes here. We're going to run back. Uh with Flowey again. Um, we're going to hit up the heel again real quick. Uh, save spot. Which was in this other room, I believe. And then we're going to go back down there. And we're hitting up the save for you guys. And uh, here we go. Continuing on. And we're going to go back down. And we are going to make it this time. I, I swear we are, you know. For the better good, uh, we will make it through this. And I think this is where I found, yep, the ballet shoes. Excuse me, I also was burped there, so that's why I sounded kind of funny. Um, so we are going this way, and yeah, this place it look really cool. And uh, that's Washi here. Um. I was just, we can't spare right now, can we? Scrub a dub dub. Aw, oh, man. I think we'll be safe there. Yep. And, uh, wants to clean you. Hops around excitedly. Ugh. Almost made it there. No! Okay. I thought I attacked for some reason. And. Washa, we're going to... You're going to hop around excitedly. Alright. And we'll mercy there. And now we beat him. This is the same way around. Yeah, so it just takes you on the same path, kind of there. Um, the power to take their souls. This is the power that humans feared. And, oh boy. Is that a tentacle? Oh, yes it is. Oh boy. What are we running into here? Oh, it's a giant smiling octopus. Hey there. Notice you were here. I'm a uh, onion sun. Oh, it's a onion octopus. Onion sun, you hear? Uh, what you doing, onion sun? You're kind of freaking me out, yo. You're visiting the waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? And uh, it's got 
Big old kawaii face. Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Uh, let's see, even though the water's getting so shallow here, I have to sit down all the time. But, you got some derp face. Hey, hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium like all my friends did. And the aquarium's full anyway, so even if I want it to, I... That's okay, though. You hear? Undying's gonna fix everything. You hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean. You hear? Uh, poor onion octopus thing. Hey, there. That's the end of this room. I'll see you around. Have a good time. And waterfall. Mm. Is he gonna get us? gonna come after us and oh Shinran hides in the corner but something but somehow encounters you anyway um, we'll check it out Shinran's attack 19 defense zero tone deaf she's too ashamed to sing her deadly song did she just fart or did she just say two Shinran's hum hums very faintly um, Smile, you smile, and you ask to see Shinran smile too. Shinran gets quieter in the corner. Aaron nods his head approvingly. Two. Shinran hums very faintly. You hum a jazz ballad. Shinran follows your melody. Siri, Siri, Samimi. Oh man. Shun seems more comfortable singing along. Conduct, you wave your arms widely, and you're now vulnerable to electric attacks. Alright. Shun seems much more comfortable singing along. Uh, smile, you smile, you keep smiling, but nothing happens. Alright, fish face lady. Uh, we have a mercy here. Uh, and got 30 gold out of it, which is pretty nice. The northern room hides a great treasure. Cool. Let's see what these signs say. This power has no counter. This power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears, and an incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one there is only one exception, the soul of a special species of monsters called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death, if only for a few moments. A human could absorb this soul, but this has never happened. But and now and now it never will. Okay. So we're gonna go check out and see if we can get this weapon up here that they uh, talk about. Oh piano. Um a haunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. X to quit. Okay, so. There's a piano here. Play it? Yes. Hunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. What does that mean? There's a piano here. Play it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, so we messed that up. So let's try that one more time here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, hmm, I'm not entirely certain on what to do here.
And, uh, so, yep, I'm not sure what that was all about. Um, the Northern Room Heights a great treasure, and I'm not too sure. Sir, me, sir, me. I'm assuming the monster might have a part to play in that. It's a statue. The structure at its feet seem dry. Um, so right now, folks, that's it for part 15. I will continue on with part 16 of my blind Let's Play of Undertale. And as always, folks, it's been a pleasure being with you. And remember to flip that bacon, and I'll see you next time.